United Airlines extending flight cancellations due to Boeing 737 MAX groundings. CNBC's Phil Lebeau is on the news line with more. Phil, looks like they're extending this through November now. Right, through November 3rd, Kelly, and that means that United will be scrapping an additional 5,000 flights when you consider the number of 737 MAX flights that were scheduled for September and October. And United is the first of the three U.S. carriers flying the MAX or that have the MAX in the fleet, the first to extend its cancellations now into that November time frame. But don't be surprised if we hear from American and Southwest sometime over the next week or two because – Boeing has already made it clear they're not expecting this plane to be fixed until somewhere in the, quote, September time frame. So that means even if they get this fixed and they apply for recertification by the end of September, it's even pushing it to think that this plane will be back in service by the beginning of November. But again, United taking it off the schedule through November 3rd. Phil, it doesn't seem like a stretch at this point to say it probably won't be back in the air by the end of the calendar year. Increasingly, uh, analysts are focused on that. And it raises the question, if this is extended out till the end of the year before it finally is resolved, does Boeing have to cut capacity further on the 737 MAX? It's currently at 42 per month. Another production cut, that would weigh on shares of Boeing. That would really be the, the next catalyst to bring the stock lower. Yep, we've talked a lot about how the shares haven't been weaker. Uh, as you said, something to watch now is that production schedule. Phil, thanks very much.